2005, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Oh, uh, hey there, uh, Cam, uh, Price. Uh, you know, yeah, I think you and me have something in common, uh, that we both hate dogs. So, uh, yeah. You see that, uh, Ether Ranch right there? Uh, kinda need it. Uh, yeah. So, let me just... Yes, I know, terrible. Uh, transition there. I have a lot of uh, technical problems with this green screen stuff. So yeah. So yeah. Uh, all right. Uh, thanks, Cam Price. Uh, I know you probably needed that for like a weapon, but I am going to leave now. Yeah. So here's kind of my ghetto setup with this whole thing. Due to the fact that I don't have like huge expenses to buy like huge lights. I don't know how it's going to turn out. It might turn out to be absolute garbage, but, uh, yeah, i got to clean all this up now so you guys can actually see it. Uh, so here's actually the ether wrench. Uh, this actually turned out way better than I thought. Green screen number one. This green screen is not as big as I thought. I remembered it being because it was on that frame, so... I guess this is easier to just place the green screen places, but, uh, yeah. There we go. Stuff was falling. Ugh. Ouch. <sighs> Look, you guys are over there. Alright. Beep, boop, boop, boop. Oh, yeah, let me move all this out of the way so you guys can actually get a good view of the fucking lighting light right in my eye. I'll put this wrench on the good side so you guys can actually see it. Little quick clean up there. So uh yeah. Like I said this paint job actually turned out it's like one of those rare moments. Wow yeah this is one of those rare moments where the paint job actually turned out good. Yeah you don't want the surface being super smooth like if you try to paint glass the paint's just gonna run off. So you have to like scratch up the surface with sandpaper. I'm not sure why I still have that light on, but I'll turn it off later. But yeah, all I did then, yeah, I took spray paint. I took black and purple and mixed it together. And man, yeah, that really did turn out to be so much better than I thought. <laughs> oh man, that turned out really good. You can see I didn't paint that or the the teeth because obviously I still want this wrench to be usable because I guess I'm gonna have it in a frame in about a second but every once in a while if it's like an emergency we need that wrench then I'll be like all right I got it oh man yeah look at the paint job I don't know this is one of those like I said it's one of those rare moments where it actually turned out good now I don't know what happened there I might have put a little too much extra right there where the paint kind of dripped off and stuff but uh yeah wow that could be like the thumbnail, like right there, ether wrench in real life. So like that could also be like the thumbnail there. Yeah, uh, oh yeah, one last thing. But yeah, how do you get the ether wrench? I'm pretty sure on all the round base uh, maps, there's like one single easter egg where you can actually get one ether wrench on Outbreak and the other PlayStation exclusive mode. You can get the ether wrench almost like from anything. You could actually get it from a zombie, I think, but that's extremely rare. Not sure, though. Wow, yeah, that's a good shot. The Aether Wrench in-game, it upgrades your rarity of your weapon. So, like, from, like, rare to epic to legendary. Now, you're not allowed to get this if you have legendary. And I tried a bunch of myths and stuff. I'm like, let's see if I grab uh, the Aether Wrench when I have the fist. No, won't let you do it. So, yeah, it really, it still does function like a normal wrench, as you can see closes i actually fixed this because it wasn't closing all the way and i'm like uh dude close all the way and then it can like open all the way or maybe this will be the thumbnail or like i 
Yeah, yep, I don't know. Alright, so now I'm gonna put together the little case I made. Here it is. And I actually printed a custom label, Ether Tool. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. So, let's see from a distance. From a distance, actually, it doesn't look too bad. Man, that really turned out well. Like, let me just do maybe a side-by-side. -side. So, you can see that, yeah. I don't know how, but paint job actually turned out decent because I just mixed black with purple and then I came up with uh, I came up with this pretty cool paint job and yeah I bent that like piece of steel looped it around and then drilled the hole in the back there and as you can see I ran out of completely orange paper or the full length so I had to I had to go for it what's weird is on camera it looks like peach color but in real life it has a more orange or orange or color so one last look I still can't believe that paint job turned out that good so yeah that's about it ladies and gentlemen thanks for watching there's a mini little build and just like always hop 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 Video's over, it's done, uh, not exactly sure what you guys are still doing here, you know you can click off to like another video at uh, any time if you want to, you don't have to, you can just uh, sit on this video and wait with me.